Oh, <laughs> oh we gotta go watch bro broke do her awkward floss. <laughs> Beef. Well, it's like a. You've got it. You're yeah. You've got it. Good morning. So it's our first day, our first full day in Costa Rica. Uh, this morning we went and got breakfast. Went and got SIM cards at. Colby, um, it was 12,995 colones, which is like about like a little over $15 US um, for like five gigabytes of data, 100 messages, or no, 30 text messages, 100 minutes, and yeah, I don't, I think that was what it was. And then we uh, got some coffee, we went to Starbucks, they had some different kinds of drinks than we do in the States. Natalie got a red velvet latte, I got something that's caramel. I think it's like burnt caramel, maybe salted caramel, I'm not sure. And then Brooke got an Americano. It's 11 o'clock, and so we're about to head to Nusara. The forecast says rain, so we probably should get out here quick before the rain starts. Um, but yeah, welcome to the Nusara vlog. I hope you guys enjoy this one. If you do, please give it a big thumbs up and make sure to subscribe for more future content. Good afternoon guys so we are on our way to Nasara. it's taking us a lot longer than we thought it would um, I think originally when I mapped it, it was supposed to be like two and a half hours then it was like three and a half hours and then it's taken us like almost five hours to get here um, so a lot of the freeways are like um, they go like from two lanes to one lane so then it carries this whole thing sorry there's a small child having a fit in the corner um, but yeah so we just stopped for a little bathroom break I'm gonna get another vapa and then we're gonna we're about an hour out from Nasara, so we're almost there So we just got to our room. I'm gonna quickly do a little room tour. Okay, so we walk in. We got one of our suitcases here, but not all of them. Um, so we walk in, we've got two double beds, and this thing is so spacious, guys. It's like a, almost like a little mini casita. And then down here, we have a cute little sofa area, coffee table. And then out this door, I do believe that in the morning, the ocean might be over there, but I can't quite tell right now. Um, but yeah, so that's our little room in Nosara. It's super flipping cute. What does it taste like? I, we'll see. <laughs> Made it. Made it. Made it. Somehow survived. Thank you to our off-road tour guide. <laughs> so many sauces. You got so many sauces. So you got this beef kebab, mm -hmm. and then I got the fried fish tacos, and then Brooke got the same over there. And then I got a watermelon marg. She got a watermelon, not a watermelon, an emerald spritz. And then I got a Coke. <laughs> a cherry, maybe like a yellow cherry. Yeah, that's, that's a, a cherry. cherry. That's a cherry. That's a tomato. That's, that's a, a cherry. cherry. That's a tomato. It's a cherry. Eat it. <laughs> well, that's whipped cream. Congratulations. It was a cherry, right? I'm gonna move this before you spit it back out on the dessert. Her face was um, a little concerning. You like it? It tasted tomato for two seconds. <laughs> Yes, we 
we have crocodiles but the crocodiles are in Osara river because it's, it's deeper and they have more food over there <laughs> so the big crocodiles are over there but what we have here is some it's too beautiful bear over there. Can you see it? Yes. Yeah. Okay. The white one is white ibis. And the other one, let me see, is blue night hero. The other one is blue night hero. This is the mangle here. It's going to get a little bit narrow, so try to make a line. Okay, you wanna go? Hmm. You wanna go? Sure. We'll let Natalie do the taboo so we don't get lost. Yeah. <laughs> good job. <laughs> How do you feel good? Oh yeah. She does this a lot. We're needy. Right. Oh. Okay. So it is our second day here in Nosara. This morning we woke up and had breakfast at the hotel. It was really, really good. Um, and then we went on a tour through a mangrove and did a, a stand up paddle boarding tour. Um, I attempted to stand up and I fell and lost my sunglasses. Um, but it was fun. It was really cool and like informative. She like, she, like pointed out birds to us and like different animals. And like it was really cool. Like it was like, um, like informational it was like informational and cool like learn about some of the birds and like um the wildlife here and just like a cool little activity so yeah we did that for the first part of the morning from like 8 to about uh 11 30 and then we came back to the room i showered because like i said i fell um in like it wasn't like swamp water but it was like not like lake or like ocean water so came rinsed off changed another suit because we have a catamaran cruise in about an hour and a half it's at two o'clock um, it's currently, I think, like, a little after 12, so we're gonna get in the car, drive over to, like, where we need to get picked up on the water taxi, um, but then, yeah, so, that is the plan for the rest of the day, we're gonna do the catamaran cruise, and we're probably gonna come back to the hotel after that and have dinner at the other restaurant, last night we had dinner at La Luna, and this night, I don't know the name of the other restaurant, but, um, we might actually just go to La Luna again, because it's actually really, really good, um, and affordable, so, um, that is the situation thus far. This resort is beautiful. Um, I will say though, there are lots and lots of, of insects, which is to be expected because like we're in like a very lush nature -y place. Um, so yeah, we've seen plenty, plenty of ants and stuff like in our room. Then last night there was a frog outside of our door and we saw a little crab and like a bunch of different little creatures, like critters and whatnot. So um, this place is really beautiful. I'm like just so happy to be here and yeah, it's it's so great. If you guys ever get the chance to go to Nasara, I highly recommend. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Mickey. Oh, I'm Paulina Mickey. and Christopher are gonna be helping us today. A um, couple of rules on the boat. Make sure you hold on to some when we're moving around. Yeah, just to keep your balance. Yeah. 